to get the three nodes of electrical circuit check the link in the comment section and install the app for free nodal analysis question by using nodal analysis calculate the current in 132 ohm resistor and pd that is potential difference across 20 ohm resistor as shown in figure so we have to find the voltage across this 20 ohm resistor and we have to find current through this 132 ohm resistor and also we have to find this node voltage so let's see solution let's say this is a node node 1 and let's say this is current i1 this is current i2 and this is current this is current i3 according to this polarity of voltages and let's say this is the reference node with zero voltage all the currents towards this reference node from this positive polarity to this reference node now let's apply we will take this on this side more like this on this side we can do calculations apply PCL that is Kirchhoff's current law at node 1 now let's say this node voltage is V1 PCL stands for Kirchhoff's current law according to KCL summation of all the current entering a node is equal to summation of all the currents leaving the current leaving the node so summation of I in is equal to summation of I out now here the entering currents are I1 and I3 I1 plus I3 is equal to leaving current is I2 so let's write I1 in voltage form so it will be 200 minus V1 200 minus V1 divided by 20 divided by 20 then plus I3 now I3 will be 100 minus V1 100 minus V1 divided by 60 is equal to I2 now I2 will be V1 minus 0 V1 minus 0 divided by 132 now let's solve this and get the value of V1 so this will be 200 divided by 20 minus V1 divided by 20 then plus 100 divided by 60 minus V1 divided by 60 and if we take this on left side so it will be minus V1 divided by 132 132 is equal to 0 so let's solve this we will take V1 common from here so in bracket this will be minus 1 upon minus 1 upon 20 then minus 1 upon 60 then minus 1 upon 132 minus 1 upon 132 so it is minus 49 point minus 49 by 660 and if we solve this so it will be 200 divided by 20 so it is 10 and this will be plus 100 upon 60 so it is 11.6 we take this on right side so it will be minus 11.6 now we can easily solve this and get the value of v1 this minus and this minus will get cancelled so v1 is equal to 11.6 multiplied by 660 divided by 49 so therefore v1 is equal to 11.6 multiplied by 660 divided by 49 so it is 156.24 156.24 volt is the value of V1. Now we got the value of this voltage. So we can easily find the value of this I2. 
I2 is equal to V1 minus 0 divided by 132. V1 minus 0 divided by 132. So, the value of V1 is 156.24 divided by 132. So, it will be 156.24 divided by 132. So, it is 1.18, 1.18 ampere is the value of I 132 ohm. That is the current through 132 ohm is 1.18 ampere. Then next we have to find the potential drop across 20 ohm. So, to calculate the voltage drop across this 20 ohm that is V20 ohm. This is V20 ohm. It is equal to resistance multiplied by current I1. That is 20 multiplied by I1. So, V20 ohm is equal to 20 multiplied by I1. So, it will be 20 multiplied by the value of I1 will be 200 minus V1 divided by 20. 200 minus V1 divided by 20. So, this will be 20 multiplied by 200 minus the value of V1 is 156.24. 156.24. Divided by 20. So, this will be 20 multiplied by 200 minus 156.24 divided by 20. So, it is 43.73.76 and since it is a voltage, so its unit will be volts. So, this is the answer for V20 that is voltage drop across 20 ohm resistor. So, this is how we can solve current and potential drop, potential difference across 20 ohm by using nodal analysis. Check the link in the comment section to get the free notes of electrical circuit and also thanks for watching.